Hello Yaffle Juice. Today is Friday, August 28th. I believe it's the 28th. Yes, it's the 28th. Um, I'm currently sitting in front of Mimi's Cafe. Excellent restaurant. Um, not what I'm talking about in my video today, but I just drove back from Huntsville to Fort Worth and my parents are meeting me here for dinner. Anyway, so the theme this week was to describe pretty much your perfect meal. Um, appetizer, main course, dessert, and drink. Um, I thought a little bit about this on the way here before I started making the video. Um, I would have to say my appetizer would be, there's a soup that's a tomato basil soup that is at a restaurant in, um, oh, what is the town? It's, I can't remember the name of the area, but there's a restaurant called Italiani's. Um, it's right outside of Fort Worth, and they have this tomato basil soup that my parents and I will go there I mean not just for the soup but when we go there we get the soup every single time it is that I mean like some people say oh Madeline's tomato basil no it is the best tomato basil soup I've ever had in my entire life and that's saying a lot because I've probably had like 20 or 30 different kinds of that so that would be most definitely my appetizer um, my main course would have to be um, Gosh, I just love Mimi's. Um, my main course would have to be uh, my Uncle Bob, who passed away a couple years ago. He made a spectacular baked salmon uh, with lemon butter. Um, I would have to have that salmon. He's actually the one that got me into liking salmon. Um, as well as garlic mashed potatoes and acorn squash, the way my dad prepares it, which is where he takes um, the little bit of the center out and he puts butter and brown sugar in it. Um, it is extremely delicious. We have that almost every year for Thanksgiving as one of the side dishes. So the, the appetizer would be the tomato basil from Italiani's. The main course would be the my Uncle Bob's baked salmon with lemon butter, garlic mashed potatoes, and the my dad's acorn squash. And then my drink would be raspberry Italian cream soda, which is raspberry syrup, I believe, I don't know if it's, I always get club soda and soda water confused, but it's one of those two, whichever one is usually put in, like, drinks, I'm pretty sure it's soda water. Um, like that, the, the raspberry syrup, a little bit of half and half, and ice, and that's pretty much it, and it's just so delicious. Um, and then for dessert, I would most definitely have creme brulee. That is my favorite dessert of all time. I really like flan. Um, creme brulee and flan aren't really all that much different, um, but most definitely creme brulee. I, I gotta, I, that hard top is just so good. So, um, that's my perfect meal. I think it kind of goes well together. I mean, I could have picked, I really like German food, um, but as far as picking different things to put into one perfect meal, um, that would be, those things would be it. So, hope it sounded appetizing to you guys because it's extremely appetizing to me. I think my parents just got here, so uh, see you next week. Yum yum. <laughs> also, I almost forgot, um, we are also still included in our videos to remind everybody to check out uh, Michelle's profile on the Fanta website. Um, if you didn't already know, Michelle um, was one of the original members of Yaffle Juice, and now she's currently trying out to be one of the Fantanas, um, and she's in the top 10, so you most definitely have to check out her profile and vote for her. Um, the link for that, I believe, is bit.ly forward slash Fantana Michelle. Um, and then another thing to check out as well is Derek's mom's IMDb page. She's uh, in a movie that's coming out in the United States, I think in about a month or so, um, called Mao's Last Dancer, and she's trying to get a bunch of people to check out her IMDb page to get her star rating up. Um, so if you could check that out, the link for that should be bit.ly forward slash Susie Steen dash IMDb. Um, so check those out, and thanks!